are back! A job well done, Mimi. We didn't do enough to say that. I might need your help again later. I better take all the items back to the workshop with me. Uh, uh. Your legs are wobbling. Are you sure you can carry all that? Uh, I'm fine. It's right there. Uh-oh. Uh, <laughs> Watch it! You're not fine. Just give me half. It's okay. I feel bad. You're going to give me a heart attack if you make me watch. Hand it over. Uh, okay. Ooh, that was heavy. I might not have made it without your help. <sighs> it's nothing. You now see how much I've trained compared to you. You're really out of breath. But thank you. You don't need to thank me. I didn't do it for you. Welcome home, Taltiri. Oh, who's this? Pleased to meet you. My name is... I'm home, Tetsi. She's my friend, Mimi. Friend? Wh what are you talking about? Did I say something weird? I... I... Uh, I'm not your friend or anything. We're co-workers. Rivals, to be more precise. I didn't know you had such an adorable friend. I'm sure Tolteri's been constantly giving you trouble. No, not at all. Um... I know. You should join us for dinner. It'll be ready soon. No, I couldn't. You should! Satsi's cooking is great. Come on! H hey! Stop pulling! Tetsi, I want to help. It's okay. You have a friend over, so just keep her company. But then Mimi will think I never help out around the house. You don't. Oh, don't say that out loud. Hmm. Mimi should visit every day. That way you'll always help. You're so mean. I'm sorry about my noisy daughters. Ah! W when did you come in? I've been here the whole time. I'm sorry I startled you. It, it's all right. I should apologize for not noticing you. Don't worry, I'm used to it. Even my own kids never notice me. Uh, uh, they were raised by a useless father like me and no mother. They turned out all right if you ask me. I might just think that way because I'm their father, though. No, I think you're right. Thank you. I hope you'll get along with Totori. She has very few friends around her own age. The pleasure will be all mine. Mimi, we're done. Careful, it's hot. I hope you'll like it. She will. Anything you cook is awesome. This does look good. It's a lot more elaborate than usual, isn't it? Oh, Dad, you were there? Overstayed my welcome. I'll get going now. Are you really going? It's getting late, so why don't you sleep over? No, I'm leaving. If I stay any longer, I think I'll start getting jealous. Huh? What's that? Nothing. Well, I'll come back soon. That's great. See you later, Mimi. And 
guess what happened next? A huge bear came out of nowhere! Really? Aren't you exaggerating again? It's true! I really wish you could have seen it! It got away from me, but imagine how much bear stew we could have made with it! Oh, there she is! Mel! Well, that's too bad for you. Hey, you don't believe me. I'll believe if you bring me back its hide. Fine, I'll get it next time, and I'll leave it on your doorstep. Yeah, yeah, plan your prank after you actually get this giant bear. They look like they're having fun. I shouldn't interfere.